<laughs> Let's go. I'll come to the next episode of Escape from Tarkov. My name's Dan Geese, and we're going back into customs. We've got decent gear. I give it B to B minus tier gear. We got a pack, a, a space ball, a base model SKS, and a chip in a chair. We got one goal here. And one goal alone. Get the proper bronze quest done. Don't get don't get sneaky. Don't get creepy. Oh, everyone said, hey Dan, turn the turn the V sync on. Hang on. V sync is on. What are you guys talking about? V V Sync's been on. Anyways. <laughs> Alright, sorry, I should have checked that prior to the video. Nonetheless. Let's dial in here. Get ourselves in a position to be successful. Alright, what do we got here? Um, we're gonna take this path, the the path of least resistance. We're going right for it. I mean, th this could be hopefully. I'm hoping. The shortest Tarkov video of all time means we get in. Get our bronze pocket watch, extract, and get out. I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't mind some firefighting. I'd be okay with that. But at the same time, <laughs> I really want to knock this quest out so we can start upping our guns a little bit. You know, get get a little, a little AK action. It's behind us. Super spiced. Man, they're popping off. It's popping over there. Let it stay popping. We, we've got our own... Our own stuff we got to deal with here. <laughs> it's so... We went from talking about staying dialed in. Running the quest and getting out. To sticking our nose where it doesn't belong on the other side of the wall. Where the wildlings are. Bend the knee to Cuphead. We bend it as we loot here. I, I would... We need it. We're about due for a victory here, huh? Alright, I don't think we're going to push from behind just yet, so let's just take it easy here. Take our mahogany SKS. Wait for any movement. There's going to be some movement. Do we just go right towards the tankard? Nice and easy here. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Do we get them? Scavs like bananas. They come in bunches. Easy, easy. We're going to quick reload. Um. Alright, so that, that sounded like a scav. It's more than a scav. It's a lover. All right. I don't know why we're, we're, we're janking up here. Hang, hang tight. Hang tight. Someone, someone's nearby. It's like we're, we're anti-walking here. There he is. There's two of them. What do we do here? There's two of them. One's here. I see the step. This we're boxed in here. Oh. 
we were we were opposite offense on that one. I thought we maybe got away. I thought maybe we got away with being sneaky there. It's tough, man. We're we're trying to get in and out. This bronze quest. It was Spice City. Here's what we're gonna do. I'm I'm anti. I'm I'm not a big at all. I'm not a big hatchling guy. But desperate times call for desperate measures. What? All right, let's. What could we have done different? I pro that big fella. I probably going up the sniper tower. Hundred percent should have pumped them. Just loaded them, riddled them with lead. I saw the second guy. The second guy scared me away. I don't know if there was a third or what was going on, but um, I'm guessing the chunky guy probably doubled back on us. We we're a little, little bit too patient. Um, being heavily offensive in the games, especially in our live stream Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on Twitch.tv slash Dan Gaisley, has really been offensive going after the rock passes has really paid dividends for us. And, and that was the opposite of that. We, we, we stayed back on our heels and cowered in an eggshell. And we got exactly what we deserved on that run. So we're going to do a hatchling run here. Um, it's not my favorite to do, but at the same time, sometimes you got to do what you got to do. In, in terms of uh, chance of success here, I'm going to say mini slims. But we're going to give it the old college try. You never know what could happen here. A chip in a chair, as they say. I mean,. What do we got to lose? You know, at this point, it's just free loot. <laughs> Look, all is not... At least we, that took some of the dent out of the last one. There's 6,000 six Gs right there. What is that? Matches, battery. I'll take the tea glass. It's an odd place from some tea glass. I'm hoping maybe the hesitation here will help that area get, get a little cleaned out because that's a heavy ch choke point on this map. Uh, is there an easy way to get there? No, we gotta, we're going to have to jump out. You guys know my concern here. Number one, make the jump. Number two, hopefully no one's on the other side. OJ. <laughs> All right, nice. So I learned to, to make this jump. You don't have to sprint. Just run and jump. All right. Let's get home here, boys. Just be a little patient. We got to sneak in the back door of that orange gas container. <laughs> 808 spam in the comments, please. All right, there's dudes up there. I mean, we're walking right in to the jaws of life right here. Unarmed. A chip in a chair. I'd like to get to those bushes. Get down. <laughs> Just hang out here for a second. Do some examination. We got some. <laughs> it's 
Just walk in front. Leave us alone. Let us be. I hear nothing. I see nothing. I think... We're gonna go for it. The only thing that hurts us here is that there's scabs. No scabs, boys. Just dead scabs. Waggle, waggle. He's creeping. He's creeping. We should have just went for the key. <laughs> Sir Wolf 72 are dishonorable. No honor in that. We try one more time. Or do we scab it up? We go three strikes we're out around here. We got to go for it. It's a hard map. I was reading online on the Reddit that people are saying like, I was just reading, you know, some of the beginner stuff. Not that we're a beginner. <laughs> or that I was looking for beginner tips. But people was like, oh, what map should I play first? Number one thing was people say don't play customs. I was really surprised. Number two thing people said or something someone said is that don't play. I mean, uh, number one, don't play factory. Number two, people were saying uh, from a custom standpoint, like don't play customs because people like come come to customs decked out to the T and. I just never would have thought that. I, th I thought custom is like a mid-range map. There's not a whole lot of incentive for people to play it. Because, you know, there's limited loot. The dorms are good. There's some hot spots, but it's not like shoreline. It's not like interchange. So I was pretty surprised to see that, you know, customs is not encouraged. Like, to me, I'm like, yeah, to, if someone asked me what, what map to learn first, I'd say custies for sure. Uh, I, I think the landscape's easy to pick up on. I think... Uh, you know, it's easy to learn the e the easiest to learn this map, but you know, to each their own. Um, I I do think it may be a little bit negligent to go double hatchet runs, but we can only test it, try it, feed the reaction, and take it from there. All right. Uh, I don't mind this spawn. As long as no one spawned right in front of us. Someone spawned in front of us, we got problems. Which we're about to find out here pretty quick. Thought I saw someone in the bushes right there. Alright, so let's keep it moving here. Uh, you know what? After... Having gone through this as a as a hatchling, I think I'm gonna start showing a little bit more mercy to hatchling. I'm not saying we're gonna take a a what. Someone's behind us. I'm not saying we're gonna take a 100% no hatchlings killing policy, but I'm gonna take it and at least digest it. Maybe hold a vote on it and take it from there because. If I knew a hatchling was just trying to do a quest and they weren't going to try and bury the the hatchet six inches deep in the back of our cranium, then I probably would let them live most of the time. But th that's the thing about Tarkov. There's no voice comms. There's no way to tell. Yet. Yet. Let us press forward here. Um... Loot this and get a little lucky. It's not what we're supposed to be doing here. 
But maybe we'll get a grenade. <laughs> I'll tell you one thing, I was not expecting nothing. Might as well, right? What do we got to lose? You never know, maybe we can offer someone some SIGs. Ooh, almost, we'll take the rupees. Hey look, all, all is not lost. We're hedging our bets here a little bit. All right, one more time, we'll search the packet. Nothing, all right. I know we should be eating those crackers and whatnot, but... Alright, here's the plan. Run... Run blindly for it. Uh... Run for it. Try to stay alive here. We have no defense. Actually, no offense here. Probably should have bought a pisty, but... <laughs> Let's hang tight. Yeah, I'll burn a bandage on it. Why the heck not? You know? Like, how not to play Tarkov? You know what? We're going to go for it. Offense. He sees us. He's locked on. Terminator scav life. We're going to try to triple back around him. He's got some kind of red hat on. There he is. Let's go, let's go. Give me the beanie. I know we're bleeding out. Live to fight another day. Live to fight another day. That's all you can ask for. Hang in here. A chip and a chair. That sometimes that's all you can ask for. A chip and a chair and a pom-pom hat. And an energy drink to quench your thirst. All right. We got ourselves a pisty, boys. Come on, just let us get in get out of here. By let us, I mean we're going to go in and take it. The unthinkables happened. ZB 10, 12. We're out of here. Uh oh. Someone's still the left of us, but we gotta keep it moving. Just go, just go. Just build, just build. We gotta get to the exit now. Forget everything else. We got the bronze pocket watch, a chip and a chair. Our legs got 2% health left.
<laughs> I don't know what else we could have done. We're, but we're not going to bend the knee. We were, we were so close to completing the bronze pocket watch. It's easy. You go in, get the watch, and get out. It's not so easy, though. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Escape, escape from Tarkov. If you guys did, clicking the like button helps out a great deal. As always, the pleasure was all mine. As always, got to get a little bit better. What did, what did it end up working out for us? Maybe recouped about 18 Gs. Thanks so much for watching. See you guys next time.